today's uh, activity here is uh, one of those uh, mundane lab activities that's often done wrong. Simply how to stuff a pipette. That's, uh, if you're going to autoclave them and use them for sterile liquid handling, then uh, you'll want to do this correctly. Uh, first thing to understand is when you take a look at uh, pipettes, uh, some are actually designed for being stuffed and some are not. The one on the bottom here, if you take a look at it, you can see that it's just simply straight through and that actually is not good because if you try to put cotton inside there, uh, it's going to pass right down through. Uh, put this one in the center. This one here is really obvious that it's designed with a very simple crimp inside it. Um, and the one on the end here, it's actually on the outside, there's a, there's a molded uh, restriction in there. And that molded restriction then is designed actually for a mechanical stuffers. There are actually m machines that will pack these if you need to do it in large, large quantities. Um, so the process of actually carrying out the, uh, the stuffing requires an important tool. Uh, that important tool is uh, nothing more than a, than a paper clip. And uh, to do that, what you need to do is then take a uh, piece of non-absorbent cotton. It actually is not a filter. The way to think of that is the cotton is actually being used as a um, uh, to, to absorb it, kind of like in the top of your medicine bottles. Um, you need to take the right amount, which is about this much, about the size of the end of your finger. Uh, then you take one of these that's been designed for the actual process and hold it on one side here uh, over the top of that. And what you're going to be doing is actually dragging that down inside. And so what you're going to do you, is take it and then you're going to literally pull it down inside of the thing. And then you can tuck the tails on the end there because you don't want those to pull out when you uh, work with it. Uh, in that way it's been stuffed inside there and uh, you're not packing it because you're not trying to make a filter out of it. You're trying to make a porous that air easily flows through and it pulls that out. So then once again you just simply pull the pieces of cotton the size you want to work with and then you take that, place it on top, put that on top here, use that to, to literally drag that down inside to the actual restriction and tuck it. So that's the uh, procedure.